Okay, so hello guys and welcome back to a new episode. Suji here as usual and what is this? Look at this, this is not harps. Starting a new episode with something I have never ever done before actually. This is to harm our coal, harmonized coal mining or whatever it's called. So I really need to get used to doing a lot more of these because these are efficient or whatever. But yeah, anyways, uh, quickly before we jump into this episode, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for the amazing support I received in the last episode. Uh, Honestly, after I uploaded the last episode, one hour after, I gained around 20 subscribers. And in total, in 24 hours, I gained 40 subs after last episode. This is like crazy because usually what I get is from 5 to 10 subscribers every day on average. But so yeah, compared to this, it's just amazing like so yeah once again thank you guys so much for uh, you know all the support other than that uh i hope you guys enjoyed this new episode and i will leave you to it and i will see you in the next episode so yeah enjoy the episode guys okay and this should be the first level of the episode guys how far are we there we go wow getting a level from uh, picking pineapples classic but yeah anyways coming in with a 98 farming a really really nice level to get so i guess yeah last push towards another 99 which is actually a really good one i used to like farming skill keep so much back in the day i remember when i got it on my main i honestly rocked out that skill keep so often but yeah anyways as i said 1.2 million farming xp to go god this will take me a while Okay guys, and this should be another level for attack this time. There we go, coming in with 98 attack, overload ran out, let's quickly read ring. So yeah, uh, one last level till maxed all, all combat skills, I guess, unless we want to count summoning. But yeah, 1.2 mil XP, which shouldn't take me longer than 4 hours. But you know, recently when I've been training my skills, I was wondering, you know, like... Uh, in my entire Aras career, I guess, if you can call it like that, I have never done, you know, skills that way, you know, when people usually, and for some reason I'm not getting wires anymore, but okay, I guess I will leer or reeler after I stop this recording, but yeah, I never actually got, you know, the skills the way where you get, you know, quite a few skills and then you just max or whatever, pretty much this spammy way I guess if you can call it like that you know when people get multiple skills 99 or whatever because all the time you know before I the broadcast came out I was obviously maxed then I was getting you know XP and I was getting each uh, 200 million one by one and I never did that so I was wondering wouldn't it be nice you know to go ahead and actually get like quite a few 99s into max overall it should be really nice you know and since you know I do have 98 farming I do have 98 attack I will be getting 98 herb lord so pretty much all the skills that are you know left for me to get 99 except for mining I guess I could do them all you know by you know one by one and you know into the max overall it would sh it would be a nice broadcast in my opinion what do you guys think to see you guys this is what I want to do it's just I want to do a lot more skills and in the end you know I want to get the a message for all skills 99 but anyways that is not the reason why i am recording clearly guys coming in with another fletching level 94 this time just afking oh dragon magic crossbow variants not bad i guess you know if i decide to get those sentient crossbows i will need to make those in the future uh, but other than that, I am just, you know, sitting here at half an because half an hour just ended and I am fletching because my raids I am actually in a raids group, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say, and we are about to go do Beastmaster, so, you know, fingers crossed, hopefully we can get that codex, that would be extremely nice, so, yeah, I will continue fletching until we start, and I should be back with a Beastmaster loot, as I said, guys, yeah, there we go, uh, leader is trying to teleport already, so, I will be back in just a second, guys. Well, this is a bit confusing, apparently my team got the kill, but the lead beast face tank died or whatever so he was spamming the league in the group chat where is it yeah there we go so i left but apparently the team got the kill anyways and i can loot what let's see wow what the hell this is unbelievable and i get the codex are you kidding me 
I fucking get a codex. <laughs> I get a codex from a kill I completely leeched. Oh my, I am... What is happening these past episodes? <laughs> I get a fang. Now I get a codex, even though, well, now I need to get, you know, a web or an eye. So, you know, that then I can decide which uh, ability I want to unlock. But what the hell is happening right now, guys? Hi, mom. Fuck's sake. I am... Oh, my God. I am speechless right now. So, yeah, I guess there we go. Uh, I th Let's check our Beastmaster KC, actually, before Beastmaster Durzag. 15 kills for my first codex and we have primeval boots as well already so yeah not bad as i said i'm not gonna claim this ability as of now because i want to get either eye or a web first so you know after so i can decide which ability i can unlock first but other than that man this is amazing shout out to these guys i guess who helped me get this skill even though like i guess i left the group at like 179k though so i guess Thank god they finished it, but this is insane, man. And that's another random daily level, guys, coming in with 93 fishing and beautiful. So yeah, this is the level where you can start doing the lowest tier, I guess, of the waterfall fishing or whatever. But uh, I might actually go and do it, you know, whenever, because simply because I want to unlock the treasure chest I think it's called in my aquarium so I can get that free elite clue every week and also there's just one another thing but I forgot it just because I don't know why but anyways yeah there we go I guess for this level and other than that six levels more to 99 for this one also I just got you know a team yak card so I know uh, so I thought you know what I might as well go and check which recipes I am missing and Apparently I actually have all of them by now, well at least you know the pages from the DG all and I have unlocked most of these as well, all I need is these last 5 potions for which I just calculated I need exactly 4.5 million pure GP to unlock and this one will be out of the way as well. I don't have that GP right now and I don't want to you know spend my entire cash stack on that so I guess when I will be you know feeling safe with, with GP wise uh, when I will have like 10 mil plus once again I will come and unlock these so you know that's just out of the way but other than that nice and let's go do something else and there we go this should be a random hunter level this time coming in with a 91 hunter so finally got around you know to using my some of my I guess at least green ball quarter tickets so 386 more tickets left sadly that is not enough for 92 hunter i should be around 100k plus xp away from that but you know uh, i guess i will finish using those and i will continue in that gujaro dungeon with crystallize most likely and look at this this is actually my iron man uh friend so shout out to him for getting this amazing draw but as i said i'm gonna you know uh, finish using these tickets and we should be back with some raxor Wow, I got excited for a second there because this message popped up right as I, you know, finished the kill, but I don't think I can even get anything related towards this color of the message when I finish a Raxor kill anyways, but yeah, uh, back at Raxor, as I said, first kill of the day, herbs. And there we go for the second kill, 444k, that looks weird, but, and strange how the value showed 60k as well, but yeah. And there we go for the third one, I think. Yeah, Eddie or nothing special. Let's move on. And there we go for the fourth kill, which is Magic Log. So one more kill to go. Well, this was fucking stupid of me. I, you know, I didn't reload new preset for this kill and I completely ignored the fact that I only had, you know, one dose of overload. So I had to do this, you know, uh, well, not one dose, sorry, two doses of overload, and as you guys can see, my freaking overload ran out, like, f you know, uh, f 50, uh, 50k before Araxi, like, when Araxi had 50k the life points, what I'm trying to say, and I didn't even have a replenishment potion this game at all, like, this was just horrible kill, anyways, uh, yeah, but this is the last kill of the day, so the last kill is Ulogs. Uh, yeah, would be too a bit too greedy, I guess, to get back-to-back -back days at the Raxor, but not complaining at all. So yeah, this leaves us at 145 kills, if I'm correct today. Yeah, I guess we will be back to this spider tomorrow. 
Oh man, so yeah, we are back to Hunter as you guys can see and I used up all my tickets and switched to this place instead and oh man, I haven't done this in a while, it feels so weird to be doing this. Uh, definitely gonna grab Road Arrows next trip simply because I have so much idle time right here simply because of my low hunter level I guess and simply I don't have the aura right now as well so I'm you know I get kind of a lot of time to AFK but yeah anyways there we go for 92 hunter guys obviously which leaves us at halfway mark there to this one as well so who knows I might actually go ahead and knock this out in one go because I kind of enjoying hunter right now for some reason okay and this should be another level there we go, actually stayed for two levels here, nicely done guys, coming in with 93 this time, so yeah, I guess three more levels at this place and then we can, you know, move on to the, how are those, golden, golden turtles or whatever those things are, you know, like those from Uncharted Isles. These are actually really good XP and I those are actually really good XP and I won't need to waste my soul runes, you know, for crystallize there anymore. And there we go, done with another Jack of Trades aura, guys, so if we can, you know, unequip it, get this book, put it on Herbler as usual, and this should be a Herbler level, beautiful, coming in with a 98 Herbler, so that is my third skill that is at level 98 currently, which is not bad, I guess. Can we do anything new? Supreme Overload Potion, actually we can. Don't think I will do these anytime soon, though, but yeah, definitely a nice level to get, so... 1.2 million last push not gonna get it 99 though because I am keeping my word and I will probably try to get as many 99s as I can at once but other than that let's move on with the other dailies Ooh, and that's a nice surprise as well as you guys can see I just completed my ca first cache of the day and I got the Viner's rope top so last Monday I think it was they added four skilling outfits from Treasure Hunter that you can obtain by you know doing in-game activities and this was the last piece so I guess yeah there we go for another skilling outfit even though this one isn't really useful for me because I don't really get much you know XP by training divination simply because I convert my memories to energy but I guess completionist wise I guess it's nice uh, it's nice to get you know this outfit first kill of the day guys is a runite ore okay second kill is cash not bad and this is skill number three Addy ore and number four quickly there we go Damn it. And the last kill. And there we go guys, back to Hunter as you guys can see. Still enjoying it, can't figure out the reason why I am enjoying it, but I guess I can do some of it more. So yeah, uh, hopefully I can stay till 95 without me needing to leave or whatever. So yeah, I guess 5 more levels to go. Okay, so we did in fact stay and let's crystallize this box. And there we go, coming in with another Hunter level in a row, level 95 this time, so only one more, oh, Crystal Impling, freaking beautiful, and those spirit things on Uncharted Isle, so that is really good as well, but yeah, uh, as I said, gonna knock out one more level at this place, hopefully I can do it uh, today as well, and after that, at 96, we will go and, you know, try our luck at the Uncharted Isles, Isles or whatever they called you know, with those golden turtles. Oh, ornate turtles, that's how those things are called. Man, this is nice, I'm happy with the outcome for sure, so I guess, yeah, first of all, let's click this, and there we go for the level, coming in with 96 Hunter, obviously. Now, as you guys can see, we can do Arc Ornate Turtles, which was the goal in the first place. But yeah, in the end, I'm kind of happy because I managed to knock out 96, from 90 to 96 Hunter in three trips. If you would include, you know, the one where I actually needed to finish my Grunwald tickets, first of all. But yeah, uh, 96 Hunter, really, really nice level. Nine, three more levels to 99. Obviously gonna leave it at 98, as I said, because of my plan or whatever. Make sure to uh, say in the comments what do you think about my plan. But other than that, though, I don't think I will go to Turtles just right now, simply because I wanna, you know, look 
them up or whatever because I never actually did them so yeah but on this level as well I am kind of going to uh, conclude this episode guys uh, a bit less pvming this episode but a lot of new you know skilling gains I guess I could say we got quite a few total level ups this uh, you know episode and quite a few level ups in general so yeah uh, as usual thank you guys very much for watching the episode let me know in the comments what you think about the questions that i asked at the uh, you know beginning of the episode and other than that i will see you guys in the next episode and take care